So some of you I know have questions like, why did this happen? Um, you try to wrap your mind around how a person can be so evil and how they can do this, not just to a stranger, but to their own family. And you'll sit there and ponder that and think about it until your head hits the pillow and you fall asleep. And you're never going to understand. I studied criminal justice and the criminal mind for 21 years. I've seen domestic violence more than I care to see. I've seen death and violence in domestic situations. Not like this. And this is something that we don't know. And it's the criminal mind. You can't understand why this happened because you don't have a criminal mind. They're different than we are. They don't think like we do. I can't think about punching someone with, outside of self-defense. I can't think about hitting someone, let alone trying to understand the brutality and the tragedy that took place here. So settle that in your mind. You're never going to understand clearly why, psychologically why, this person did what he did to his own family. Prayerfully, justice this time will prevail. I'm believing it will.